Hello everyone, this is Wobby Ganahu here, and welcome to another bite-sized LP of a very obscure Sonic game that you might not have heard of. Yep, it, we got another Sonic game, but it's not called Sonic the Hedgehog, it's SEGA SONIC THE HEDGEHOG! SEGA SONIC THE HEDGEHOG! Uh, no idea why it's called that. Then we're gonna put him a chorus in, cause this is actually an arcade game here. Yeah, and we got choice of players Sonic, Way, or Mighty. Yeah, this, this is the first game Way to find Square, Mighty Armadillo first next to Pearson. And it's the only. the only game Way ever next appears then to Sonic Mania Plus, and also I got to play as Mighty, because he's my favorite Sonic character. And yeah, everything's in Japanese since this only came out in Japan. I think this was originally gonna be on on a like mega collection or gens collection, but apparently they can't put out in it because you control this game with a, a trackball controller. Oh, oh joy! Oh god, oh god! The graphics on this game is absolutely beautiful. Oh sweet Jesus! So yes, this is actually an arcade only game that was actually getting to play here for the very first time. And you know, trying to animate this game was pretty damn difficult to do. I had to get like a special arcade emulator and try to get it working. And of course, trying real hard to map the, the weird awkward trackball controllers on my Xbox 360 controller because yeah, control controlling this game is really weird. The controls are not really like, great because obviously you control with like a, a rolling trackball. So yeah, the controls honestly suck, honestly. But yeah, you just basically way of doing this game is just go from point to point B you know? in a and the game is. Oh, way down the first level, volcanic fall. I'm going to roll the place. <laughs> Why are you laughing at? So, this is Arcade Sonic game here. There's seven levels here, I assume. Seven, eight levels, so. Next stop is Icy Isle. But yeah, the game's at an isometric F. Angle, so this is actually a precursor to Sonic 3D Blast. Oh, yeah, the music here is bloody awesome. Go! Cool. Yeah, so this is an arcade game, so your players back in the day. Yeah, if you die one, once, you gotta put another quarter in. It's a. Yeah, it's a. It's a quarter eater, that's for sure. So now, before we go play this way. Oh, so they have help bars. Uh, okay. And I'm dead already. Okay, well. I don't know why Way sounds like a girl. I, mean, I know Tails is voiced by a girl, but this is taking the Mickey. Yeah, I think all three characters. Let's control the thing, really. Yeah, um, yeah, no, I don't say, yeah. Uh, oh, this game's pretty fun, I can lie, you know, it's stuff for your money. A bit of money, guys. Sure, you didn't even get ports to any, uh, any collections, really. I've been pretty happy to play this game, but oh well. It's already the same feet as Knuckles Chaotix, it seems. I'm basically trying to be very careful here. But yeah, it's an isometric 3D platform, like just like Sonic 3D Blast. Uh. What? Okay, I beat... Yeah, as you know what you're doing, this can be a very short game. Oh, yeah. Yeah, also you want to get as many wings as possible. 
possible in order to get the highest score now. This is our arcade game, in which getting the highest score is possible, so. Now we move on to the third level, Desert Dodge. I don't know. So yeah, this oh god, this game's mm, kind of mad. It's fun for a short burst, but it's it's definitely designed to make it put in many corners. There's, there's many possible ways to die here. I mean, sweet Jesus. Oh. I, nope, Sonic's dead. Nope. Yeah, now I'm playing good old Sonic now. Just showing off the three cowards here. Don't like Tails isn't in this. So. Did this came up before Sonic 2? I don't know. Yeah. I mean, bugging. I should to try to get through the skates, but it's possible. I can't learn anime yet, so I know it's not like I need to put actual coins inside my computer. <laughs> Looks like Sonic also has the Inter Shield, I think. I don't know, I could be wrong. Oh, look, the tornadoes can. Okay, no, get. No, get I'm not looking at weapons to that god awful game. Okay. Uh, so yeah, not even what to say, really. Yeah, this game was only released in Japan. It never came out in any other country, so... Yeah, it's called Desert Dodge. What a weird name. Yeah, I don't really care about wings. I can always put in a bunch of... ...bad course keep going on, so... Alright, let's go ahead into Trap Tower. Oh boy. Is this where all the booby traps are made? Do you want the booby trap or the non booby trap exit? Non booby trap, please. Then go that way. Or oh, name was that way. Yes, I'm going. Sweet Jesus. Yeah, in this game, everything basically wants to kill you. Sweet Jesus, I'm... Not even Crash Bandicoot had this many death traps. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh. Oh, Sonic is d dead. <laughs> wow. He dies just like how Crash Bandicoot dies. This is like Crash Bandicoot before Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, you're not gonna be playing as my favorite armadillo. Oh, it's gone up here. No. Oh, mighty. Yeah, he truly is mighty. Wish he beat him all gains though. Yeah, if it's the only other game we need to appearance in, just Sega, Sonic, and Knuckles Chaos, that's it. I like that. I like going through the booby tracked exit. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> I'll stop whether seeing Battle of Bikini Bot already. Okay, <laughs> we're halfway through the game already. <laughs> yeah, as you know what you're doing, this game can be pretty short. Thankfully. To know what you're doing, or just have a million corners in your pocket. Shane is getting there, came to your poor America. Okay, just gotta keep running. I assume you get more continues if you pick up as many as you can. Mostly, I don't since I'm emulating this. Oh! Come on. Yeah, these track pulls controls really do suck. I mean, what more one for? It'd be a good idea to control game using a a bloody a bloody spinny ball thing. It's like the least precise controls you can use, aside from full body motion controls, of course. Yeah, yeah. What would be what would be worse? 
using the trackball or using like a, using the Kinect? Because that's actually a good question. Hmm. I uh. What? Was that a painted wall? Oh, I love how cartoony this game is. Ugh. I'm trying to break it. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Oh, and there we go. Ah, oh, screw this isometric angle. Landslide limbo, eh? Alright. Yeah, yeah, whatever. On to the next level. Wire waterway. Oh, great, another water level. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, okay, uh, Gotta keep moving. Oh. Alright. So, yeah, sh Again, Shane just never came out in other countries or even on other collections, really. I mean, this is definitely a, a Sonic 1 game not a lot of people got to play, unfortunately. I mean, this is a fine enough game, just kind of brutally difficult because getting spent to hog all your corners. Actually, I believe there's another arcade Sonic game called Sega Sonic Brothers. I believe that's like some sort of puzzle game. Maybe I'll cover it? I don't know. I don't know. Probably not. If you're wondering if I'm gonna cover Dr. Robotnik's B&B machine and it's Game Gear counterpart, then... No, I'm sorry. I just suck too hard at Poyo Poyo. So unless you want me to cheat on those games, I'm not gonna do... Dr. Robotnik's MBM. Alright, let's do some good old rock climbing. Oh god. Nope. Okay. Uh, come on. Here's another case where the isometric angle can go screw itself. Uh. Nope. Yeah, I just keep falling into the bloody water. And go for infinite lives. Well, infinite corners. Yeah, but the only reason you can beat this game is if you're Mr. Birds. <laughs> Excellent. Or Mr. Krabs, I guess. I don't know. Or Bill Gates. Or any which person you can think of. I look dead again. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck this part of the game. Yeah, oh, you gotta see how real sensitive controls are thanks to the crappy trackball. You just fly all over the damn place. Make it real difficult to make precise. Did I saw a nice show to jack from him? Detach from him. Alright, got through that hell. Alright, I think we're on the last level now. Oh, no, no, not yet. We're on the penultimate level. Uh, no, 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 wait. <laughs> what am I saying? Alright. Yep, we're at Eggman's Tower already. Oh, God. Fire! Alright. Uh, please, let me through. Screw this isometric angle! Alright. Please! Oh, fuck, I'm just gonna force myself through this. Yeah, I wanna say there's no insta shield in this game. Oh. Man, see, everyone really does want me dead more so than usual. Alright, uh. <sighs> Just 
Look at this isometric angle. Alright. Come on. Hug the walls, it's sure. Wait, have I done this already? Ugh. No, I'm dead again. Come on. Here we go. I go. And uh, no. Wonder how many cores I used already. I know yen. Okay. Yeah. I just can't do diagonally with a trackball controller. Oh, hi, Eggman. I'm sorry, I don't speak Japanese. Oh. Self-destruct. What is this, Metroid? Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, 20 seconds to get out of here, and... This tunnel is definitely really blessed. It took me plenty of tries just to try to get this down. Again, thanks to the crappy trackball controller. Yeah, and... Ugh. Yeah, look at that. Only two seconds that's spare. That's really bloody strict. If you don't nick in time, time you get yeah, me again. I ain't got to do the entire thing all over again. So that sucks. But we do it. We go to see the credits. And oh my god, this credits theme absolutely awesome. Probably one of the most underwear Sonic tracks of all time. So yeah, that was Sega Sonic the Hedgehog. It was released only in arcades, in Japan only. It never got home console releases. It never came on any collections at all. It never came in other countries, so... The only chance you play in the game is by downloading the Mam later, later and a Sega Sonic Warm and trying to map... Find back the trap ball controls in the Xbox 60, so... I don't know trouble, is it really worth it? Eh, not really. There's much better side games, but if you're ever extremely curious about this real skill game, then go try it. It's not really that half bad. Just prepare to die a lot. <laughs> bye bye, Eggman! <laughs> okay, so there you go. That was Sega Sonic Hedgehog, and after that, I get to enter my initials. Oh, well, next thing I'll just put in my name. But I kind of screwed up, so... I put in an N instead of an M, so... Instead of Sam, I'm Sans. Please not... Please not with the Undertale references, but anyways. So there you go, hope you enjoyed this quick little Bicycles LP, I'll see you for whatever I do next. See you later guys.